going to show you how to make a customized image that you can use to go and print your water slide decals off. So first things first, we're going to open up our browser, go to a website called canva.com. It's going to take you to this page and you can sign up or sign in if you already have an account. And all it is is a, a design layout that you can customize anything you like. So we're going to go ahead and make something that looks like this. We're going to choose the logo, which is 500 by 500 pixels. That's just the image size. You can use whatever, whatever size you like. And then they have all these different um, designs to choose from. We're going to make a the side walls of the mug. Flip it around a little bit. Control C, Control V. All you do is click and drag. It's really simple, really easy to use. And come on. No. Yeah, no. Let's try this again. Come on. You can do it. There you go. All right, so we're just going to line these up here. That looks pretty good. Uh, let's go make our mug handle. Let's get our handle over here. Bring the second one down here. And then our final bit. And that looks pretty good. I'll just play with it a little bit. And there we go. Line them up. So that looks all right. Let's 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 go ahead and make the loading bars. It's like you're charging a battery or something. Then we can go with green. You can change the color here to anything you want. Play with that in a second. And then let's get our control C, control V. We're going to get four bars. We're just going to drag them down here. Line them up. Okay. You can you can kind of play with them a little bit, make them bigger, make them smaller, until it comes out the way you like. Alright. Once you have all four of these lined up. We're going to change the color, you know, a nice bright green. And then, you know, maybe a little darker of a green for the second bar here. And an orange. Sorry for the background noise and the clicking, unfortunately. That's what we have to deal with. Let's go ahead and make a, a red. There we go. And then once you have this all designed up, go to text. You can add some text. They have all these different types, all these different fonts. We're just going to add this basic one here. And I'm going to line it up right here. Type in full charge. Add another one. Line it up. There we go. Sufficient for a fourth, or excuse me, a third. We're going to go with low fuel. And then finally, our fourth one right here is going to be code red. All right, once you have that, you can, you know, play around with it, customize it however you like. We're going to add a fourth down here, or excuse me, a fifth line and then say coffee meter and you know you can drag it around right up here so that looks pretty good now we're finished we're going to go to file then down to save and you can design it or change the title to whatever you like Title it Coffee Meter, and then download it. It'll be downloaded straight to your computer. And from there, you can go ahead and print it off.
just like you would a normal sheet of paper. There you have it, a customized um, design. All right, I hope that helps. And comment down below if you have any questions. And subscribe for more content. content. Thank you.